because the lighting is a lot better, but a wild Venonat has appeared, my friend. That is right, baby, a brand new Pokemon. I think there was a seal on my screen as well, but when I went outside from that little vlog bit, it disappeared, unfortunately, so... Oh, yo, I'm terrible at this, man. Look at that Pokeball. It's going rolling off. No, I'm literally so bad at this. Right hand, please do a better job, I swear. Yo, yo, what are you doing? No attacking, please. That's it, that's it. Look at that. Great, come on. Make my fourth Pokemon to my Pokedex, I bet. Two, three. Woo! Baby, we've never actually failed a capture so far. This is, oh dude, this is sick. Literally, my life from now on is gonna be driving around, not caring where the heck I am, and trying to capture every freaking Pokemon. We've got ourselves a Venonat. It had no bug bite and Scybe. You know, that's a good move. I like that Venonat. Welcome to the squad, my friend. All right, I think it's time to get out of the car and hunt down this little post box. Boys, look at this. I'm on the way to the post box. Look what's come out. A rat attack. Come on, boys. This is gonna be sick. We're out in the wild. We're literally becoming Pokemon trainers. Welcome, potentially, fifth member of the squad. You know, you want to. Yes, boys, this is, dude, I'm addicted. Rattata was caught. This could be enough to level us up to level three, potentially. Welcome, my friend. Let's see what moves it knows. Knows hyper fang and quick attack. That is lit. Is it enough XP? Yo, level three, baby. What are we going to earn? Five Pokemon. Register five Pokemon in the Pokedex. Ooh, that, nice. That's one thing we've earned. Ah, so we completed the Kanto. Five Pokemon found. Next up is 50. That's pretty tough, but we're completing little things as we go along. And this is actually a cool journal of everything we've done so far, which is pretty much just capture the most basic Pokemon. All right, look what we found. It is the golden post box, my friends. Now, let's see what it can give it. Wait, is it going to give us anything? Let's see what it's going to give us. So we've got ourselves loads of Pokeballs from finding this golden post box. So you, it's not just a case of seeing things on the map. You've literally got to go up to it and actually grab it. So I think we can come back here potentially every day and get rewards every single day. So this is going to be a regular spot, I reckon. Ooh, it's just registered our level up. Let's see what we got for hitting level three. 15 Pokeballs. I need them because at the moment I'm missing so much. It is unreal. <laughs> All right, guys, I don't quite believe this, but driving home, I've somehow come across a gym that's nearby, so let's check it out. Looks like you don't have much, much experience as a Pokemon trainer yet. Come back when you've re- What? It's just, just literally told me to bun off. You can see over there, that, my friends, is a gym, which is really, really close to where I am. I thought I wouldn't have it anywhere I live, but it appears there are. So, I need to rank up a little bit more, and when I do so, we'll be able to take on our very first gym, which will be so sick. I found another thing. So just here is actually a sushi and Chinese place that Claire and I love to go to. And it just happens to be a landmark on Pokemon Go. How mad is that? Let's see if we open this up. Yo! Okay, we get ourselves three Pokeballs for hitting up the good old Mikado. So thank you very much, my friend. Three Pokeballs is just what I needed. The addiction doesn't stop. This is probably one of the rarest ones we've found. So, yo, okay. So basically trying to hit them on the head is the goal here. So if they're quite a big or jumpy Pokemon, you have to give them quite a big flick. Yo, that's good. That's what we're talking about. That's got to be a catch. Woo! Another Pokemon added to the Pokedex. I can only imagine how hard it would be to get like a Zapdos or a Legendary. Like how mad that would actually be and how hard it would be to capture as well. Boys, it is mad. Peachy Otto, arguably the best Pokemon we've found so far. Ooh, this is, ooh, yo, 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 yo. I think this could be a hard capture potentially. Come on. Come on. One, two, three. Woo! Uh, my car even made a buzz as well. I think that is the best Pokemon we've caught so far on this game. I've actually worked out what the CP number as, as well means. I, mean, I believe it means combat points. So the higher your CP, the better the Pokemon. So this knows Aerial Ace and Steel Wing. Oh, that is a lethal combo. Boys, I found an Eevee. I, like, I've literally been driving for so long. You won't believe where I found it. I freaking found it at my gym. I found it at my gym. It is literally outside the gym that I go to here where I live. Oh my gosh, we need to capture this. Eevee, I beg, I beg you do not freak out on me. Come on, come on. No, no jumping. Oh my gosh, okay, no. It's still winning. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. One, two, come on, come on, come on. Three. Oh, boys, we have caught Eevee. I do not believe this. I did not think this would happen. I've been driving around for so long trying to work out where this Eevee was. I can't believe it's just outside my gym where I go to every single day. This is crazy. No, Swift, 
and quick attack. Yo, it's getting close. It's getting close. This is good, boys. This is really good. It's only two steps away, and it's the closest Pokemon to us. I swear we're going to run into this. I swear. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I found it. It was actually just outside the pub that Claire and I went to literally just a few days ago. So I'm going to take a seated position and make sure I catch this guy. Now, one thing I haven't used since last episode, since getting them, is actually Great Balls. They look awesome. I can now get them from Pokestop. So I'm going to go for my very first ever live on camera Great Ball throw at a Haunter. So let's give us a go. Nice little cheeky one. Beautiful. Great throw. Guys, did you see that? Great throw. Okay, no one around really cares. It's, I did actually see two guys walking by on their phone. Focus, Ali. Focus. Yo, are you mad? Are you mad? A great ball, great throw. That's disrespectful. No, no, Haunter. I know you're a good Pokemon. Your CP is not high enough for you to do this to me right now. No, okay, 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 okay. Think, Ali. Think, 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 think. What do you use on Pokemon that aren't going in the Pokeballs? You use a Raspberry, right? Okay, Raspberry fed up. He's feeling juicy. So, great throw with a Raspberry. There's no way this guy's popping out right now. What? What? How do people capture like Dragonites when a Haunter won't come out? I'm throwing another Raspberry. Take it, my friend. Take it. I've used like five Great Balls already. All right, well, it's in the Pokeball. It's not a great throw. I may have to give up on this guy if he keeps him popping out. One, two. What? This is the hardest capture ever. This is the hardest capture ever. I'm amazing. It's gonna... I'm amazing. I haven't ran yet. This is unreal, dude. I'm going to have to go past so many Poke stops to fill up after this. Two, three. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. How long did this thing want to take to get caught? Wow, okay, well, new Pokemon added to the Pokedex Haunter with one off Gengar. Let's check how many or oh, 100 ghastly candy to evolve into Gengar. Ah, oh, well, Claire and I actually want to go on a late night adventure, playing Pokemon Go in the darkness, finding ghastly, finding horses, and ultimately trying to get a Gengar. So if you guys want to see that, look out for it soon. All right, guys, so I am literally less than 100 XP off of level 14 now, and I'm against a rat attack. That's so ratty, but the thing is, and the issue is that the higher level you get obviously the higher CP the Pokemon get which means it's then harder to capture even the basic Pokemon like Pidgey and Rattata which means you need even more Pokeballs even more Great Balls which means to staying at home like this guy's just come out of my Pokeball straight away which means that you have to go out even more and like grind out all the Poke stops to get those balls otherwise you just don't have enough to capture them like all of these Pokemon taking like a good two three plus balls like this guy's just not going in it's a freaking Rattata so the grind's becoming a little bit harder but after we've caught this which we should do we'll be able to level up thankfully it only took one more ball after stop been talking but yo look how many Pokemon <gasps> oh my god okay an egg is hatching oh my god it's all kicking off we're leveling up the Pokemon around us an egg is hatching okay it's a magic carp but that is actually really good news although it doesn't sound it because that will actually give us magic carp candies so we're 23 <laughs> out of 400 which is oh my god I've got four Pokemon around me and I'm hitting level 14 great balls nice super potions not so nice I just need as many balls as I can get to be honest because it's so easy to run low but let's check in actually on our egg so actually 0.2 kilometers away from finishing off a five kilometer egg i said i'd do two kilometer eggs today so let's throw that one in and get that hatching and hopefully you should get that one hatching in this episode as well it should be awesome so we're making progress boys i like it so guys the things are literally kicking off right now i've literally just taken this gym you can see on my screen it's being attacked i told you guys that little animation basically meant the gym was being attacked last episode and i've got two gyms under my control but for the moment like because we're being attacked and i'm back in my car i am going to go to the shop and then quickly go to the shield and quickly just cash in those two gyms i think we've literally just lost that maybe have we lost just lost it? yeah literally that's just gone to a neutral gym so i cashed in with a second to spare but basically i've done all my errands in town today taking on two gyms in the local area using the electric bars i'll show some clips of me actually killing the gym and taking it over myself i had to do it twice over but my electric bars are so strong man 800 cp he's an absolute boss on top of that i actually went to the dentist and while i was in the dentist one of my eggs hatched so i'll show that right now and i was like oh what's it gonna be what's it gonna be i can't get excited if it's amazing so i'm in the middle of a freaking dentist turned out to be a Nidoran male, which is actually awesome because what I'm going to do right now is go to my Pokemon. And honestly, I got so many candies for that Nidoran male egg, which is really cool. If I give it about terrible 10 CP one, I now have 25 CP. So, oh, here we go. Oh, wow, I've got two. I didn't know I had that many. All right, well, my best um, Nidoran seems to be the 207 one. So, we can evolve this bad boy into its evolution, which I believe is Nidorino getting close to Nido King. I think this is an epic evolution. It's such a good chain of Pokemon. And this is the very first gen and having a male and female sort of like versions was really cool and really different And look how badass he looks man. That is awesome It's also gonna give us loads of XP as well And I'm trying to get up as many levels as possible. I think I said I wanted to get close to 15 I think that's gonna be a little bit too much to ask for this episode But that is awesome a hundred now candies needed to get up to Nido King and he's got 340 CP not bad I'm just redoing my route one more time 